What is up guys, Marvin here, back with a brand new Endure SMP, got my boots on, and first off, I should make some iron armor actually, because I almost died like 50 times already, and yeah, and if you're wondering why I'm out here, I'm not going to tell you guys yet, you will find out in a little bit, but first, I've never gotten the achievement, uh, pig off a cliff, and if you look, I have everything. So I was thinking to, let's do that right now. So let's find our victim pig. Uh, what's your look? This guy, look at this guy. Look at Stan, look, yeah, you don't look at me. Okay, so I'll get on you now and then you'll follow me. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you go this way. Go this way, go this way, there we go. There we go, okay, hopefully I don't die. <laughs> Ride that pig, I'm riding it. Oh yeah. Okay, so let's just go right off. I think there's a cliff right here. Yeah. Oh crap, there's water. Oh yeah. When pigs fly. I'm too strong. I'm too strong. I'm too strong, guys. Too strong. Goodbye, piggy. Alrighty, guys. So the plan for today is to build an ice farm and a snow farm. And if you guys have been a long time subscriber, you know I already have made an ice farm and I wanna build it back on here, but I also wanna make an ice farm. And this one's a little different than the one that most of you know. It's uh, one that Panda4994 uh, made, and I'll link his in his uh, video in the description. And basically you run in a long straight line all the way down. You know what, we should sleep. Uh, uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, there we go. Thank you. And um, so I want to build that, and I also want to build a snow thing because I would like to have ice on the the server because there's really not that much, and it would be nice to have ice. I don't know why. I'm just in the mood for ice. And so, but the plan is I wanted to make the snow thing like pretty big so I could AFK for a while because uh, I did make an AFK AFKable snow farm. Uh, so I want to have lots of chests. So I was thinking to put it like right here. Maybe like curve, like have the machine here and then have the chest all right here. And like, uh, I'm talking like five up all the way up because that might be enough snow. And then we'll have tons of snow blocks because I want to build with snow blocks. I really like them. And especially with this texture pack I'm using, I really like the way uh, it's coming out. So I think the first thing we have to do is, I'm trying to remember. So I, I have everything here already. And you know what? We should make trap chests because we're going to need a bunch. And I have tons of wood. I'll uh, we'll make all these trap chests. I don't even know how much we'll need. This will give us a. Uh, actually, we'll make half a. Half. Half reg. Uh, no, that only gives us half. So there we go. Dang, that is a lot of wood, actually. But anyway, so I want to make the ice farm so. Um, um, basically, by the time you're done harvesting it, you could harvest it again. Um. You could harvest it again. Now Jay's throwing me off my thoughts, but let's see what else do we need here. We need sticks and we need iron. All right, so let's see. Uh, but so yeah, so there's a ton of ice on the server, and then who knows? I might even open up an ice shop, uh, and snow shop because I don't know. I find that really cool, interesting. Uh, how do you make these again? No, no, like that. Yeah, and I only need thirty-two. I'll grab 40 just in case we need some extra for some other, you know, maybe we want to do, maybe I want to add some like cool modifications to the ice farm to make it super cool, like trip, speed, potion, ejection thingy, and it's an auto brewing thing. I don't know. Who knows? Uh, but let's see. Boom. There we go. All right. So let me get all these materials and junk. Actually, you know what we should do? Oh, oh, is he going to get the achievement? Let's see. Let's see if he could do it. Go. I'm right behind you. You could do it. <laughs> it's so slow. Uh, he's going to get it. He's going to get it. Uh, will this count? I don't know. I got to go off that clip. Oh, he got it there. Good job, Jay. Good job. Um, but yeah, so we should <laughs> light up this area a little bit, at least where I'm working, because... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god she's so important to me help me fulfilling my dream <laughs> uh but yeah so i don't want any mobs to spawn because i don't have that good armor that's why i made the iron armor <laughs> you're welcome for starting the server i know i know i know 
big help. What do you guys think of this texture pack, by the way? I like it. It's like it's based off what I used to use, but it's more smooth, and I really like it. It took a like a day or so to get used to, but anyways, while I'm lining this up, I want to tell you guys about what happened today. So today I got my wisdom teeth pulled out, and if you guys ever seen those uh, uh like movies. You know, like the movies, uh, they'll have like there'll be a character that has like a random flashback, and well, he has that flashback. Uh, it's like only bits and pieces of like a story, like it's never like the full thing. And I actually experienced that, and I I was pretty shocked. So basically, I go into the doctor's. He's like sits he he sits me down. He takes all my vitals and stuff. You know, my heart rate, uh, my blood pressure, stuff like that. And then he uh, gives me an IV and then gives me uh, the thing that makes me super sleepy. And I pa uh, I don't even remember passing out. All I was talking about football. And then next thing you know, um, I wake up. And when I wake up, I'm in a wheelchair. And I'm super like, I was super loopy apparently. And um, so with that, with that loopiness, I, uh, I remember a one part where this girl was talking to me, this nurse girl type chick lady i think i don't even know what she was uh she's talking to me and then next thing you know she said oh uh we're gonna go put you in your mom's car now next thing you know i i i guess we went through an elevator or something i don't really know but we wake up i, I wake up and they're loading me into the car i'm literally like dead body i can't even walk uh and then next thing you know the next like flashback type thingy is when i'm i'm in the car and when i'm in the car i I remember getting into the car and driving off and then I and then that was it you know I died again or whatever and then it was I remember getting home and my brother recorded a video of me asking me questions and I'm like super loopy I don't even know I was like I don't know what time is it I was like what it's already that time and I was like freaking out I didn't know where I was and anyway so then I remember getting on the car and then the next thing you know I remember waking I remember waking up three hours later and I'm like what the hell like I guess they gave me some strong medicine but yeah but i thought it'd be a lot more painful uh but i can't believe that i'm already even recording this commentary and i'm pretty sure i sound normal um but yeah so my wisdom teeth are gone so that's a you know plus i thought it would take me like a few days to recover but uh there's a pain every so often but nothing major nothing major but all right so i'm probably gonna throw up this uh i'll probably build the snow farm off camera and then we'll do the storage room uh together ish i guess because uh i have no more stories that was my one story that i had to tell you guys and i'm out of torches also so that is perfect timing so ready snap your fingers and there will be a ice no i lied to you again snow farm right there so guys this is built and if you did watch my tutorial before uh, i did move this uh mechanism from out here to in there because it just went well with uh um uh, terrain you know i didn't want to have a giant thing sticking out so yeah so basically i just built the same thing but uh mirrored it onto the other side but anyways i want to test this out so i want to see if this will uh just even work in the first place so i have one slot open for a shovel and these are all filled with iron shovels uh, and the reason I'm not using stone, even though I think it's the same, is because we just have lots of iron, and iron lasts longer. Uh, so I don't have to mess with the settings. But anyways, this is going to take a second. It's going to take uh, like one cycle to give me a thing. That's the downfall with turning it over there, uh, putting it over there. But it doesn't matter. You know, I'm just holding down right click right when the shovel comes in. and I mean, left click. And let's see how much we get. And I'm going to need to block that off right there. But I'm just trying to make sure that this breaks before I get a new dispense shovel. Or I want to get that timing like pretty accurate um, because the longer I don't have a shovel the snow I'm wasting which I could could use you know could be using but let's see oh, it's getting close to breaking oh, I'd already dispensed another one all right so that is a little too fast and I'm still okay so yeah let's turn it off man that is that is a fast machine I'll tell you right now I wonder what snowballs we picked up uh, I still haven't done anything with this, but let's see. That's already, uh, we get s 16 blocks. Wow, that's actually over a stack of blocks. So you get about a stack of, actually, wow, pretty dang close. You get a stack, about a stack of snowballs, a little less than a stack of, a little less than a snack stack of snowballs 
per uh, iron shovel, which is actually not that bad. So then I can calculate how much, like, oh, if I want to go through all of this, I could be like, well, this will give me um, uh, a double chest full of snow blocks. And, you know, who knows? And it doesn't take that long, too. It took, like, uh, 30 items, set for 30 items, or 28 items. But let me grab some dirt really quick. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, dirt. There we go. So if, okay, I'm trying to think. So four spots in a large chest take up uh, a 16. So I'm trying to calculate how many chests would I need to store those amount of snowballs. That's one, two, three. You basically need two rows per stack of snow. No, yeah, per stack of snowballs. So that's going to take a lot of chest space if there's only uh, one two three three and you need 27 that's gonna be uh not that bad but anyways let's increase this to um let's go to 35 34 actually all right let me put this back in the system and let's test it one more time uh okay it's left click i i didn't know why i was thinking it's right oops it's right. Uh, uh-oh, uh-oh, this is bad. Turn it off. Turn it off. Got to fill out my inventory first or it won't work. And I got to get that snowball out or I'll just collect the snowball. Uh, throw into the system. Thank you for the shovel, but I'm going to have to put that back in the chest. Did the thing reset already? Uh, it's almost there. Come on, you could do it. Uh, and then it's going to have to come back, so I might as well just take it out. It should come back now. Or does it stay there? Oh, oops, my bad. All right, here we go. Turn this on. Inventory good to go. And let's see if this works this time. Because this is actually going to be a lot of snow. I made goose to snow also. Snow is not a bad building block in my opinion. But let's see. Let's see if this works. It's getting ready. And here we go. Oh, yeah, this is amazing. But yeah, so if you guys are thinking about building this, I definitely think you should because it's a lot easier. You know, it's auto uh, storage and stuff. You know, everything's automatic, and uh, there's really no downside, in my opinion, to this. Uh, the material, it's not even that long to build. It took me 15 minutes to throw it up, and the video is 9 minutes. So, yeah, you get the idea. So, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Well, that's going to be a problem, actually. Oh, we don't want to, we got to stand a little back, but is a new one. Oh, a new one is dispensed. Well, I didn't even time that. I wasn't paying attention. But anyways, uh, I think it needs to be, I don't know. I will check it and I'll get right back to you guys. Boom, an igloo. So they set up a J right over there. Hello, J. Uh, he helped me come up. He did the igloo. I did the floor, and he did the you know little path. And we worked together on this, and you know it looks pretty nice. There's a nice storage room. This is snow under. I don't know if you could see it, but yeah. Uh, so we already got a little bit of snow, but the plan is to fill up all of these double chests eventually with uh, blocks of snow. That probably won't happen anytime soon, but you know um, that'd be nice. But okay, so part one of what I want to do today is done. So now I'm going to collect a ton of snow and then I am going to start laying out the, so I want to have eight like tracks which start from like about here and you run all the way down to this other end and the way it works is, or maybe, you know, maybe eight, I think eight's a good number to start with and if we need more we'll add more, but you run down and there's ice above your head and you're holding it down like that and you're running through and then you get it all the ice and then once you go through all eight the first one should be almost about frozen again you know give or take a few water blocks but it doesn't even matter so uh, this is a good way to get tons of ice fast for giant projects or just you know you like to build with it and it's good to have in, in case, instead of water buckets actually and I prefer ice that's what I've been using lately so that's what really got me to get this ice thing but anyways I'm gonna set up the first uh, track thing and let it freeze over then I'm gonna so guys, I just started to, you know, power through and build it, and uh, this is it, and it, it's really, really cool. So I have no ice on me, and I'm pretty sure it's all fully uh, frozen, and it works like a charm. We did, I did make, 
I probably rebuilt this thing with Jay like two or three times, but we finally got it to work and it looks good. And yeah, it looks like so. Basically, there's a so this is this is what you'd consider like one uh, part of it, and we duped it. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times. And you know, if we need more, we'll need more. But I, if I did the calculations, it's gonna take about three full harvests to get a double chest full of ice. But anyways. I think we should test this out by uh, doing a time lapse. Don't you guys agree? All right, let's do this. So that was a quick little harvest and it took me about three minutes to harvest all that and I got one two three four five six and uh, 17 ice and it looks like a lot did fall on the floor we might have to do something to pick that up like I think it's because uh, there's not another half slab on here and there's not a half slab on here so uh, basically they're getting stuck up here but once we uh, figure that out we could uh, make system a uh, hundred percent and uh yeah so it's awesome jay got this silk touch one i'm breaking through efficiency three pick and if you guys are building an ice farm i really suggest an efficiency three pick because first it's cheaper to repair and you still insta mine ice which is uh something really really cool and let's see yeah so there's still a whole bunch of ice but if we do notice uh let me just head over to the other side uh so yeah we did miss a lot but it's still it's a hefty haul if we go over here this is where we first started and I would want to say that uh, a lot of it is already frozen again. So if I wait five more minutes, I probably could go take another run at this, uh, which is really cool. So, you know, I got some some ice over here. And it is uh, it's looking good. You know, we almost got a, a single chest full. Uh, actually, I made my calculation. I meant when I first said you get a double chest full, I meant with about three harvests, you get a single uh, chest full because this has been two harvests now. Uh, and you know we're a little under and there's some uh, modifications that I need to make but anyways 
Okay, can we get in bed yet? No, so let me put this back. The ice pick, it's only for ice, guys. Hopefully, uh, people also... Actually, there we go. Here's my picks on my sword. Uh, this sword away. But anyways, okay, so... I think that I'm going to start on the floor now. So the floor is a design I came up with that's uh, pretty cool. And let's see. Uh, do we have any uh, lapis here, I wonder? If we don't, I might need to go get lapis before we can start the floor. All right, let me go run to the uh, spawn and get some lapis really, really quick. So, guys, I brought our banner and McDubs over, and they're checking it out, and McDubs loves it. And uh, I actually got all the resources I need, and I want to give you just a little quick template idea on what I was going to do. So I'll just work uh, from right here, I guess. So the plan was to use uh, birch snow and dark blue glass because they go together good. Because, you know, you also want light here, but you have to be careful about the light level because uh, ice actually does melt. Uh, so the plan was to go something like this. Let's see, let's do the other side. Uh, the farm is done, not the aesthetics. Aesthetics. I think that's how you spell it. I don't know. Not the best spelling. Uh, there we go. So it's going to look something like this. Uh, let me just fix this one. And then we're going to have down below here, we're going to start with uh, glowstone. Then two snow blocks, then glowstone, then two snow blocks. And then we're going to, let's just fix this all with, uh, let's fix this with, um, <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. It's such a weird word and hard to spell. Uh, but we have something like this, then we go with the blue ice, or the blue, uh, and something like that. So it's something that's simple. You get light, and it has the all the colors we're using because we're using birch, snow, and um, and glowstone, and we have the ice above. And uh, this source is not supposed to melt, by the way, if you're curious. Because let me explain something really quick on how it works. So um, if you didn't have the source block here, there'd only be sources in the middle, and they wouldn't make an infinite spring. But for example, say I crush these out, uh, or this one has water that pushes against it to make a uh, a um what's the word like an infinite spring and then that goes all the way down so if you guys are like oh why isn't this one freezing it's because it's not supposed to but okay i broke that i was about to say like i'm pretty sure this shouldn't freeze uh, uh so people like it and yeah because i know dubs it wants to be a hoarder but i'm pretty sure yeah th yeah this shouldn't freeze because light level 11 and above ice freezes uh, but I'm just going to sit back and watch that just to make sure because I don't want to build the whole thing and have to tweak it. But I did test it and it should be good to go. But anyways, I'm just going to copy the design all over, you know, all down and around. And then uh, I want to work like on a house type thingy to store all this uh, ice and stuff. And, you know, if, if people ever want to come and grab it. So I will work on that now. Well, guys, so after lots of uh, attempts, I did the floor because uh, I was worried that this was like backwards and this and uh, blah, blah. It didn't work out, but it finally did. And, you know, the sun setting and Gospy is back on. He was an original server member over a year ago and he disappeared for a few months, but he came back. And, you know, we will always uh, always welcome him here because he's a great guy. But anyway, so this is done, and look at, oh, I got shade from the top, <laughs> look at all this ice, it's so nice, oh snap, oh wait, look at all this ice, it's so nice, I'm like mice, oh crap, I got this, we should eat some rice, oh, it might suffice, for the right price, oh, guys, guys, it might suffice for the right price, I could sell you some old spice, or a different type of merchandise. Stay away from lice, or you will be imprecise. Holy crap, I'm a poet and I didn't even know it. Oh my god, that rhymes too! I'm a, oh my god, you guys see that? I just made a rap from nothing, from ice is so nice. But anyways, yeah, the ice is so nice. Uh, I already got a single chest full, um, and 
yeah it is nice and lots of crap in here um but i don't think we're gonna build this front part today because i want to keep the episode or this is like all i have time for today but i think next episode we might go out looking for a base i am not sure yet i think i know what i want where i want to do it but i'm not sure but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and i am about to go on a mining trip right now and probably with the next episode i'll share with you my results because <coughs> i made a bunch of efficiency five picks uh efficiency five and efficiency five because i'm gonna go haste mining and i need the diamonds i'm all out and you know i just hate being poor on the server but yeah so this is looking good so far we m i might just finish the rest of this off camera and i do actually i filled a lot of these up with snow and uh, yeah it goes all the way to here i think is right empties out yeah besides just the rest are all full which is um it's pretty nice you know but um and the afk thing is amazing but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this episode i'm on minecraft make sure you subscribe stay tuned for the next video which is tomorrow and i will see you guys later